So this is kind of a funny story. Um, I've wanted to taper off coffee and caffeine for a while, but I'm like, oh, I'll get to it, you know, some other time, right? Well, I accidentally did it. And it wasn't until I was realizing, you know, like I was feeling really horrible. I'm like, what is going on? I had a headache, I was really tired, and I uh, just wanted to go to sleep. And I looked back at my mood over the last couple of days over the weekend, I'm like, man, I've been in a bad mood. And it was like that in the morning. And I figured it out somehow. I looked at the coffee that I had been drinking, and it turns out I bought the most useless coffee ever. It's decaf, you see that? <laughs> decaf. And so, um, I'm on like day two or three. Um, I read online that the withdrawal symptoms for caffeine peak at 24 to 51 hours. So since I'm already through the worst of it, um, I think I'll just go with it and, uh, and just cut caffeine cold, cold turkey and uh, see the results. But I've noticed a lot more aches and pains. I still have a dull headache right now, kind of lightheaded. And, uh, but it's nice to know why I was feeling so, so bad. I, I had a few carbs and I thought, geez, did that do it to me? But um, no, I think it was definitely the lack of caffeine. And so I accidentally <clears throat> stepped off from it. But um, anyway, <laughs> funny story, I guess.